you know, the reality of the matter is this. Cosmetic surgery may make you look good. However, laser vaginal rejuvenation will make you feel good. One without the other is like the cake without the icing. Everybody has something inside of them They don't want to let other people know Oh, oh, your little secret Is the way that you grow Our reality shows your reality Are you this one? Maybe all your parts are interchangeable You can both What we want people to know about this show is we want to show them the real reality of cosmetic surgery. We want them to understand what we feel as surgeons, what we go through as surgeons. She is a smoker mm -hmm. and I am going to do a tight tummy tuck on her and she is not, she's thin just for the same reason that I may not be able to bring the belly button all the way to the groin. You know, sure. both of us, what we have to do is, is not compromise. He can't compromise on what he's doing and what he normally does. We can't compromise on, on what we do, but we have to come together and blend together to be able to pull these things off. Doctor in Greek means teacher. We will take it upon ourselves to teach. What we have to do now is open up the posterior mucosa, posterior so that we can get to the very important muscles, the levator ani muscles, and fascia. Fascia is a covering. You know, here it say fascia, but that's the covering. You know, 10 years ago, no one knew what laser vaginal rejuvenation, our designer, laser vaginoplasty was. Now, I have people from all over the world e la diffusione della sua metodica sia eh, diciamo ben accettata dalle nostre pazienti italiane. And I would estimate that this methodology could definitely be developed, applied and well received by our Italian patients. Very good. Ho conosciuto un gran chirurgo. Today I got to know a great surgeon. E credo di aver trovato anche un buon amico. And I think I actually have found a very good friend. <laughs> you have. <laughs> you have okay. likewise, okay? <laughs> That's our whole mission, to empower women with knowledge, choice, and alternatives. I found that all I had to do was listen to women. Each and every one of these procedures have been developed out as a result of listening to the request of women. Now I'm not happy with the way I look. So it's very hard for me to even walk around in front of my husband that I've been married to for six years naked. I'm constantly, when I get out of the shower, I cover myself and just don't, I'm not free about walking around naked with them. So I think that'll help out a lot. Well, I know that Dr. Matlock and Dr. Katasha are going to do an awesome job, but still, you know, in the back of your mind, you, you just, you're nervous about going under the knife. We are performing surgical procedures that aren't performed anywhere else in the world. We want you to come away from this and say, hmm, I didn't know that. And we're going to enhance the buttocks. We're going to do our famous Brazilian butt augmentation. We're really going to augment all this area right in here, all this over in here, okay? We're going to give you nice, aesthetically enhanced buttocks, a very nice, beautiful buttocks. Now, you're going to see this really come up here. Really, the majority of the shape of the buttocks comes right from here. Now I'm going to inject right in the mid portion right here. Go ahead. After each and each syringe full, I'm going to mold the butt. I'm going to mold it. It's really bringing out the buttocks. Very, very nice. I feel a true bond with me 
in the patient, when I hold the patient's hand. It feels kind of funny in here, you know, it's gonna feel kind of funny. You know, but we're all right here for you. We're gonna take sure. care of you. You feel good about the margarita? I do. All right, here you go. <clears throat> this is oxygen, I'm gonna hold it real light, okay? okay? I'm gonna tell you everything that's going on. You got all connected to the monitors. I'm gonna start giving you some more medication. Everything's great, everything's fine. We're right here for you. We're going to take care of you. Don't worry about anything. Now, this medication may sting or burn when it goes in. Patients say that it stings or burns when it goes in. That is stop. That's normal. When you feel it in your hand, going up the arm, you feel it, that's normal. You're going to drift off right now. You're going to get a little dizzy, maybe. Eyes are going to blur. Everything's fine. Women want to be heard. Women want the best sexual experience possible. We are expected to look gorgeous all the time. Your butt starts sagging, your boobs start sagging. So I think, you know, it's, it's kind of hard for us to deal with, with age. Um, we try and look our sexiest for the men. We like attention and um, we try to keep it that way. She's, she's excited for me. She's, she's getting a little nervous. I think she's starting to feel how I'm feeling. Extremely nervous right now. <laughs> how are you? Good. Nice meeting you. May I start with your breast? What do you dislike about your breast? Um, they're very saggy. It just seems like there's a lot of extra skin from, um, because when I was pregnant with the kids, they got big and then they shrunk back down, so. Most of the, it's just that they sag. If you don't mind, may I examine you? Okay, you see here, this is where your nipple should be, mm -hmm. okay? And this is where your nipple should be on this side. And if I, if I look at your chest wall here and your tummy, if I put a bar here, you see the majority of your breast has gone right. more down, so your chest wall is almost semi-empty. I do have a question. Yes. Um, when do we decide how big I'm going to go? <laughs> you tell me. Women are pushing the envelope and wanting, Doctor, I want the Wonder Woman makeover. I want laser vaginal rejuvenation, designer laser vaginoplasty, liposculpting, Brazilian butt augmentation, tummy tuck, breast lift, breast dog, nose done, eyelids done. They want all these things. Women are coming in throughout the world requesting these particular procedures. So we had to change, we had to adapt, we had to develop out a surgical team that can comply with the wishes of women. We want to talk about risk. We want to talk about complications. I want them to understand the fears that I have, the concerns that I have in treating patients. Am I, am we going to compromise anything? Are we going to hurt anything? Is there going to be any particular problems whatsoever, say, with the breast? Tell me about it. I, I need to know. I need to understand that. First, she's young. She doesn't uh, smoke. Uh, she has only a little scar down there. So the fact that I know sometimes when you do liposuction in the, uh, in the flank area, you may affect or higher, which I know you do a good job and you go always and you blend in the chest wall area with the tummy and that's really beautiful. It's really gratifying to know that you have developed something and pioneered something that are, that's helping so many people throughout the world. After having four kids, it makes everything kind of loose up there. So, you know, when you run or jump, try to jump on a trampoline with the kids and uh, kind of embarrassing because you wet yourself a little bit. What we are doing is cutting edge surgery. What you're going to see and experience is cutting edge surgery unlike anywhere else in the world. We're going to explore it. We're going to give it to you. We're going to educate you.